so I swear. Oh! I hear you. Oh, my. Hear what? I hear your whistles. Oh no! Someone gotta be in here. Oh my God! Whoa, it's been a minute since I played a horror game. Wow, 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 wow. Oh, it's been a minute. Fears of Fathom. Fears of Fathom. Man, like Scoob. Hello, people. Welcome, welcome back to another video. Today we are playing Fears of Fathom Iron Bark Lookout. Uh, this game came out about a month ago. Come on now, dog. Not gonna lie, I'll be honest. This game was everywhere, all right? And I tried my hardest not to, 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 to be spoiled of what this game contains and everything that's within it. The one thing I seen was like this one scene of like him being on a tower and then like a group of dudes turn around and look at him. <laughs> and uh, here we are a month later, Jack Nelson, a 24 Four year old fire lookout transferred to a new outpost as he settled in his new home. He couldn't shake the feeling that something was off. Little did he know what was transpiring down in Ironbark State Park. He survived as he made the right choices. Now, this is based on a true story, right? Yes! right? Yeah, yeah, I, I believe it's a true story. Stories by the people who survived these traumatic events. So, sorry to the person that. I'm, am I sorry? I'm sorry. Yeah, I'm sorry. What, what, why did I regret? What? I am terrified. Let's freaking do it. Iron Bart Lookout. May 12th. Hey, I noticed you were requesting story submissions while I was watching a YouTuber play Fears of Fathom Carson House. What I'm about to recount happened when I was 24, so at the time. It feels kind of weird telling anyone about this because of the bizarre and absurd nature of the whole thing. But I feel like doing so might help me process my memories of, of it. I knew that sharing the story anywhere else would be a dumb idea because people would say I was lying. As I'm writing this, this was the scariest experience of my life. I got chills reading that. I'll be honest, I got a little bit of chills down my bones. I'm terrified now. I'm Jack Nelson. I had a small job as a park ranger in a state park. I was a fire lookout station in one of the largest forests in the Pacific Northwest. Miles and miles of dense forest managed by the forestry service. I had a salary that allowed me to make ends meet, but I couldn't afford to treat myself to restaurants, nice clothes, etc. My biggest accomplishment so far was being able to buy an RV for myself with a lot of financial help from my dad. That RV was the only sense of home I had at the time. Oh, okay. This one time I was transferred from one outpost to another because of some f official circumstances. It was a minor inconvenience to me though since I lived out of my RV and liked traveling. I said a few goodbyes and I was off to the new location. It was about a two hour drive. Oh. Okay. Oh, nice little RV. This is cozy. All right, so he's just a not a hitchhiker, but he's on a he's on a road, and he, he's you know he's uh he got an RV with the help of his dad, and um he's about to start this new job. Nice. Okay, spit. I don't know who this is, but he's snapping. Nice. Uh, Kayla Nelson. Um, how is it looking? Still on my way. Van decided to pull a flat tire on me today, out of all the days. Isn't it late? If I don't starve to death before arriving, I'll be fine. Did you pass Roseburg yet? No, why? Okay, that's Kayla Nelson. We're Jack Nelson, so maybe that's our sister or something? I'm, that's what I'm thinking. Uh, who is this? Mitch Scott. Uh, let's see. May 9th. I'm guessing today's May 9th. I don't know. Maybe it's super, it's super recent. Um, where can I park my van? So you're arriving on Friday. Just park your truck around back uh, on the gravel. Park, park by gate D. Got it. Okay. From there, you'll find you'll be on foot. Take the Gold Creek Trail. From there, it'll take a couple of hours for you to reach the tower. Got it, thanks. You'll probably see Billy at the gate. Just show him your ID. Okay. All right, so Mitch Scott, I guess he's the one who's helping us get like get to our job or something. Park a truck on the back, on a gravel, gate by, uh, gate D? Gate D, so we gotta remember that. But if we land in the wrong spot, we probably get kidnapped or something. So we definitely need to read these texts and, uh, you know, instructions. All right, so let's go. Let's go. I'm not gonna lie. I lived a very solitary life. Okay. It helps quiet my mind, keep the memories at bay. He 
Man, this radio though. They got some good tunes. Better than the ones from the last one. Oh. Oh, it's a truck. Let me move over. I missed it. Ah! Oh, oh. I always love the great outdoors. Dude, almost. My life flashed before my eyes. Just being surrounded by the nature gave me happiness. That's cool. Heck yeah. I felt like I was at home in the woods. Aw. Kayla Nelson. Sister. Eh. What? Um, I remember this diner while passing Roseburg. They have the best burgers in town. You have to try them out. I could really use a good. Turn the radio off. Turn it off. Turn it off. Oh, it's good music, but stop. I remember there's a diner while passing Roseburg. They have the best burgers in town. You have to try them out. I could really use a good meal before the staffing starts. Thanks, Kay. Uh, there's a diner while passing Roseburg. They have the best burger. Okay, we go. We're gonna stop by the diner. All right, this is our. This is our home. This looks very homey. Not too bad. Not too shabby. I like this. Nice. All right. Well, let's go stop by that burger joint, I guess. We haven't eaten yet, so let's do that. But this seems uh, not too bad so far. You know, we just on the road, though. It's like a regular, you know, camping trip type beat. Kind of. Like, pretty normal. But we'll see what happens when we actually get to our job. You know, we have to park at Gate D or whatever. Take the Gold Creek Trail. Very weird instructions. Oh. Okay. Is this Roseburg? Is this Roseburg? This is Roseburg. All right. It's a lovely little town out here. Wow. There's a gas station. Where's the okay? Where's the burger joint though? Oh, I saw the diner killer was talking about. Yeah, that's it. Okay. Sure. Let's go to the diner then. Let me go ahead and uh park. Let me park. I'm an all-time champ parking champion, by the way. Stop. If y'all don't know this. All-time parking champion. Who is that? Ugh, he in. Ugh, you can hear him smacking through the window. Ain't nobody trying to hear any any of this fool smack around in your mouth. Okay, okay. How we how are we gonna how are we gonna do this? How are we gonna do this? Parking champion, two-time parking champion. Boy. Uh, no, three times. My bad. Boy. Uh, 1986, two two-time parking champion. Just give me a sec. Just give me a second, bro. Just give me a sec. Oh, I wasn't very proud of my driving. Yeah, where's the door? Where's the door? Right here. Ooh. Dang, that's some nice parking right there, boy. How you doing, sir? You look like you enjoying that burger. Oh, yeah. oh what is this ASMR? Get out of my ear. Okay, this about made me gag for real. Stop. This dude right here is something, bro. How's that burger? Right? This little piece of heaven. This place is pretty much my weekend spot. You know, you new around here? Um, dang. I mean. He looks pretty normal. I guess I can tell him or just passing through. I'm just passing through. I don't know you, sir. You don't know my business. Uh, have a safe journey. Thank you, random stranger. You killing that burger. Don't choke on it, okay? Pause. Don't choke on it. He got sauce on his shirt. Blech. Okay, stop, bro. I can hear everything. I can hear all his sounds in his stomach. This man doing a live ASMR audience for nobody. A live ASMR for nobody but himself. What a freak. Here's a diner, though. Ooh. Okay, this is definitely for the uh the senile people. <laughs> Sorry, not senile. Welcome to Twin River Diner. How are you doing today? Um Good, how about you? Feel free to take any seat you like. I'll be right with you. Alright, thank you, ma'am. You look beautiful today, by the way. She's so nice. Nice. I love customer service. Customer service. Where do I sit? These some nice these some nice looking old people. I like that. How you doing, sir? You look a little lost. Uh, just tired. This place has some great coffee if you're in the mood for one. As you can see, I'm usually go for vanilla latte. So where are you headed? That's none of your business, sir. <laughs> That's none of your business. I guess not. Yeah, it's not. I guess it's not. It's literally not. Like who? Who are you? I guess he. I guess he's trying to be nice. He's trying to make conversation, but like, stay in your lane. You know, stay in your lane. Enjoy your coffee, sir. Your latte. <clears throat> so, uh, how's the food? He just stared at me. Do you mind if I join you? He just stared at me. Pretty long day at work, huh? 
He just stared at me. What's your problem, sir? What's your problem? You're nonverbal? Say it. Say if you're nonverbal. Just say it. If you're nonverbal, verbal. Yeah, I'm nonverbal, apparently. How you doing, sir? Long day of driving, huh? Where are you headed? None of your business. Why everybody want to know where I'm at? Sorry. Uh, I'm heading north to make a delivery. What about you? Sorry. He, he, he was, I was talking to him. My bad. Dang. Uh, I'm annoying. I'm heading up north to make a delivery. What about you? Uh, just down the road. I'm not telling these people where I'm going, bro. Like, what's, what's up with them? Ma'am, I think I'm ready. Please take a seat. I'll be right with you. Uh, could you point me to the restroom? It's right over there. Thank you. You lied. The restroom is right here. Nice. <sighs> now, swing it Bro did not lift up the seat either. He did not lift up the seat. I'm not mad. All right, let's sit down. Oh, let's sit down, baby. Yeah. Bro, I can still hear the burger dude eating. Good evening. I'm Barbara. Are you ready for your order? Are you ready to order? Sorry. Yes. So what can I get for you today? Uh, let's see. Meatball sub with chicken nuggets, cheeseburger with fries, grilled cheese sandwich with onion rings. What? Huh? Who made that? Plankton? I don't, I don't know about that, bro. Uh, chum bucket? Nah. Meatball sub with chicken nuggets. That don't even sound right, but it's better than everything else up here. I'll take that. Very well. Would you like anything to drink? Um, coffee. Perfect. Anything else? Uh, that would be all. Thank you. Great. I'll bring the food out as soon as it's done. Just let me know if you need anything else. Sounds perfect. Appreciate it. Oh, she's so nice. Give her a raise. Now. Give her a raise. That was so, that was good customer service. That's what I live for right there. Heck yeah. I can still hear the dude eating the burger in my left ear. He doing ASMR for real. So how was y'all day? Miles was pretty good. I just, I, this is my like second recording today. This is my second game. Whoops, my bad, I'm breaking immersion. Um, I'm so tired. I've been on the road all day. Man, I can't wait till I get to my job and uh, you know, actually do my job. <laughs> I'm just talking. Oh, thanks, ma'am. I'll leave you a tip. I'll leave you a tip. Oh, she gave me three sauces, too. Oh, nice. Consuming. Dang, no sauce. He picked the whole thing up and said, Arr. Heck yeah. That's how you do it. I figured it'd be a while before I, get, I had a meal like this again. Don't say that. Eat the meatball sub. I ain't gonna lie. Those are some huge meatballs. Those some dumb, dumb, dumb things are large. Three big bites. Oh, my sister. Uh, so did you end up going? How was it? I'm here, still eating. This is so good. Heck yeah. Thank you, sister, for the recommendation. Uh, oh, we got a lot of sauces. Oh, I thought that was somebody at the window. I was about to freak out. Told you. Heh <laughs> heh. This food reminds me. What? This food reminds me, you should send me that casserole recipe you were talking about. I might get a chance to immerse myself in the art of cuisine in a new lookout. Wow, yes. I'm on my way home. Send you in a bit? Uh, yeah. Send it when you can, ma'am. Heck yeah. What a nice sister. That was so, like, cool and nice. Nice. We finished everything. I am stuffed. Oh. Okay. All right, sir. Don't forget to wipe and wash your hands. Did you enjoy the food? Yes, ma'am. It was great. Thank you so much Would you like to have anything else or should I get the check? Uh, I'll take the check Okay, I'll be right back. Thanks. Like freaking yeah, here's the check. Your total is six dollars What now see I can tip her right? The game Wants you to think like oh this waitress was so nice. Give her a tip. Give her a tip But guess what we're gonna need that money later I know we will, but you know what? She was kind. I'm a sucker for uh, kindness. I am, so I'm going to give her what she deserves and hopefully that doesn't lead us to a path of destruction and demise. Ma'am, I'm about to give you a tip. 
15% to be exact, this might lead me to a road of terrible darkness and despair, okay? I might die if you do not appreciate this 15% tip. Thank you so much for treating me so well. I've never oh, been treated brother. this kind before. Thank you so much. Here you go, ma'am. I love you. Mwah. Dude, this dude, 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 I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. I know I need that money, but she needed it as well because she's working here and she did a great job. Okay, hope you enjoy the rest of your ride. Thank you. All right, it's time to go. This was great. Y'all have a good day, okay? Um, you was mad when I came here. Are you still mad? Please leave me alone. Okay, I'll leave you alone. Ah, my stomach full, baby. Woo! I love Rollsburg. Time to get back on the road. Heck yeah. That was pretty good. That wasn't too bad at all. All right, sir, enjoy your burger. You killing it too, like, it's not that good. Stop, it's not that good. Maybe it is, who am I to say, you know? Who am I to say? All right, let's get the heck out of here. Turn, turning, turning, turning. This thing turns like a boat. All right, we out of here. Nice, that was pretty good, pretty good. All right, let's go this way. Back on the road we go. Ah, yeah. Eight o two p.m. Nice. This music is nice. Hold on. Dun, 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 dun. I want to include the location of this park. Really? Okay. But I don't want anyone seeking out the utter horrors I've seen in these woods. Uh. Okay. Oh, this is him talking like after being here. Is this it right here? I guess this is it right here. That's what it looks like. I'm not sure though. I drove past the trail at first. Hold on, let me read the message. I'm kind of like, sh I'm shaking now. What's going on? Is that normal? It is. That's called fear. Um, just park your truck around the back of the gravel. Uh, what? Oh, on the gravel park by gate D. Got it? Okay, from there you'll be on foot. I'm guessing this is gate D. Yep, let's just back up into this. Don't hit the fence. All right, there's another RV here. I'm freaking out. Hello? Am I where I need to be? I think so. Is anyone in here? Someone probably sleeping in there or something. My bad. I probably ruined his sleep or something. Hello? Yo. Yo, I'm new here, I'm new here, I'm new here, I'm new here. This is my first day. This is my first day, I'm new here. That man gonna pull the blicky on me. I think this is it right here. Oh, here it is. Gold Creek Trail. Um, From here, you'll be on foot, take the Gold Creek Trail. From there, I'll, I'll take a couple of hours uh, until you reach the tower. A couple of hours? Okay, sure. Man, I'm freaking out already. He said it's gonna take a couple of hours. What if I go in here? Someone gotta be in here. Oh my God! <laughs> Oh, 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 bro, bro, oh, he wouldn't be Rick Grimes so bad. Why can't he just greet his, his employees like a normal person? Why? I'd have smacked that hat off your head. I won't do that. I'm not that. I'm not that aggressive. I'm sorry. I just, bro. It just like, bro. Just like, just like, welcome. Holy moly, you scared me. What? Holy moly, you scared me. I thought you. I thought you were one of them. One of who? And you scared me. What are you talking about? Yeah, you scared me, sir. May Lord have mercy. Okay. Anyways, can I see your permit, please? Uh, I'm not gonna say you're Billy, right? Cause I, who knows? He's probably gonna lie. Um, oh, I'm not a camper. I'm the new transfer fire lookout. I was told to report here. Um, I, I'm scared to tell. Who that? Who that? Who that? Sir, who's that? Do you do you, do you have employees out here as well? Hmm. Okay. Sure. Sure. That's what I'm going to assume. Sure. Okay, uh, I was told to report here. For what for? Oh, I, I guess I gotta tell them. I'm the new transfer fire lookout staffer. Is that correct? I didn't know we were hiring this season. Well, yeah. 
Hang on, let me check on that. Sure, I guess. Shut the door. I ought to steal that blick out of your hand. I won't. I won't do that. I'm not evil. You know? I'm a villain, not a monster. Nope. Okay, pal. You're good to go. You're, st uh, you're staffed at Fire Tower 11. I apologize for the confusion. I was under the impression that the tower would be left unstaffed for the season. But here are your keys. What? <laughs> but here are your keys. Sorry. <clears throat> Let me open the trail gate for you. Okay. Keers? What is Keers? I don't know. We got a tower key though. So we are we are at tower 11, apparently. Alright, thank you so much, sir. Uh, since you're arriving this late, you might, as, you might also need this flashlight for the long hike to your lookout. Um, yeah, I thought I might need one. You be careful. Take this. Alright. Welcome to Iron Bark, pal. Now for our purposes, when you get to your tower, be sure to make sure your first weather report from your system just so we know you clocked in safely. If need be, you can reach out to tower 12 during your staffing. Nice enough guy. It'll be your, clo your closest contact in case of any emergency. I noticed that they're trying to get me to say Billy. For some reason, I feel like this is not Billy, and he's going to take that name and run with it, and it's going to be our, uh, it's going to be a problem later on. So I'm not going to say the word Billy. I'm not. You have a good day, sir. Throw? Can I just throw it at him? Oh, oh, sorry. Hey, just a piece of advice: don't travel any further than half a mile or north of your tower. Wait, why, why is he telling me that, though? Why? Do not travel half a mile north of the tower. Why? Dangerous woods that way, pal. Bobcats, bears. Yeah, surely. Bobcats and bears. Gotcha. Nasty business. I bet. Um. You got it. You got it, bud. Thank you again for the flashlight, park ranger, sir. And don't try to scare me again. All right. Oh, shut the door in my face. Dang. Who do you think you are? Rick Grimes? You're not Rick Grimes. He want to be... Missing people. Brick... Brittany? Brittany. Hugh Jessman. San... Sanita Williams. Dang. Iron Bark. Man. I love my job already. You know what? How about we go ask for a raise? How about we go ask for a raise? Sure. Sure. We saw a man in these woods. Where he at? Where he at? He works here too? He's an employee. He's a fellow employee. Sure. I left my bag in the RV at first. Oh. Oh, right. Let's go get the bag then. Right. Get in it. Get in our. Why my door open? Did I leave it open? Shut the door. Shut the freaking door. Who in here? What the freak? All right. Where's our bag? Here's our bag. This is it right here. Let's go. Man, I can't wait to start this job, dude. Hopefully it pays well. Surely, right guys? Surely. You get, get a nice big check at the end of the day. You know? A week's worth. A month's worth. A year's worth? Surely. Surely, surely not. I'm talking too much. If you new here, I'm so sorry. But I talk when I'm scared. You know? Some people freeze up and just like, uh, don't say nothing. But me? I got a lot to say. I got a lot of questions. All right. 11.32 p.m. Oh. All right. Um, it was a long hike, and it was starting to get cold now. All right, here we are, Tower 11. Frequency 155-92500. Who out here? Bigfoot? Man, keep going, bro. I'm already hearing stuff. I'm already hearing stuff. Is that the tower? Hex nah. That's it over there. Okay. It's loud out here. He said there's bears out here, too. Bears and bobcats? I'm worried about people. People are more terrifying than animals. Just saying. You never know what they're going to do next, you know? Power, uh, Tower 11, Lacey Trail, Gold uh, go Creek. Okay. Okay. This is where we go. Up here. Man. I, I can't believe this, though. Well, what I can't believe? I don't know. Um, imagine being out here alone for weeks at a time. It's not for everyone. Shoot, you're right. But I've always had a fondness for the outdoors. Okay. All right. And that's cool. That's fine. You know, you like adventure. That's okay. Who's in here? Nobody. What's in there? Nothing. Okay. 
I wasn't looking for poop to eat, you know? I didn't, I didn't even have to say that out loud. There's a, a cabin over there, like a little shed. Let's go check that out. Anyone here? Anything here? A cat? Bobcat? What the freak? What is this? It's quiet in here. I don't like that. My hands are full. Okay, well, I guess we can come back. <gasps> oh, I get it. Those are like our tools that we'll need uh, eventually. So right now, we just need to set up, you know? We just need to get to the top, you know? Heck yeah. Let's just get to the top, and then we'll go back down and get those gadgets. I ascended the stairs to the top of the tower. Ooh. I'm afraid of heights. I'll be honest. I am. I am, but I'll be fine. Once you're at the top, once you're at the top of the tower, you uh, your job is to look for fires. All right, this is it. Got the key. Ooh, the cabin was filled with the aroma of wood, giving me a sense of comfort. Yeah, I can imagine that. I was finally in my new home for the next few months. Next few months? Excuse me. Okay, sure. Throw the bag on the bed. Dang. Well. There's a lamp here. How you turn on the light? I forgot to turn on the generator first. Okay. Oh, sorry. Let's look around first. Let's look around first. Let's look around. Let's look around. Okay. My anxiety is through the roof. My anxiety is through the roof. My anxiety is through the roof. Roof, 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 roof. Man, I'm shaking right now. All right, we got to turn the generator in order to use our lights and stuff. That's insane. I get it though. We're in the wilderness, you know? We're in the wilderness. Turn it on. Turn it on. It's gonna be loud as heck too. Why can't this just be like a normal job, you know? Very normal. Very normal. Lights. Nice. Look at that. Iron bark. Free department. Fire department. Sorry, not free. I'll keep this flashlight in my hand at all times. What is this? What the heck is this? Bear spray? Bear spray. Okay. Ain't no, bro, you is, you is not gonna stop no bear with that. Everybody knows you have to draw a circle under you. Everybody knows you have to draw the bear circle. Circle, yeah. All right, here we are. Radio equipment was sitting on the wooden table. Uh. Oh. I don't know how to do all this. Okay. Starting rainbow 98. Surely it's not Windows. Password? Um, one, two, three. Ah! Check the iron bark ruse flyer. Iron bark ruse flyer? <laughs> it's too quiet, bro. Uh, system password is iron bark tower number. Okay, we are. Okay, 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 okay. I get it. Nice. That's cool. Delete. Iron bark eleven. Wow. Boom. Hacking complete. I'm a genius, dude. All right. Uh, dang. This is an old computer. Uh, Hello there, it's Smiling, your trusty virtual assistant. Here to help you to and what you make the most of your computer today. Thanks, Smiley. What's on your mind today? Not you. Clickety click. Here's a random fact for you. Mount Everest was the world's tallest mountain. Continues to grow a quarter of an inch, uh, 0 0.6 centimeters tall each. I don't care about this. Why are you telling me this? All right. Uh, well, he, he said when we got here, we had to do our first weather. Thing, our first weather report I think so uh, service weather report let's see how do we do this though oh static more static new guy I haven't gotten your name yet what is it again uh first of all who is this I'm not about to give you my name I'm Connor fire tower 12 I saw oh. your light turn on oh okay he's a fellow comrade Com com comrade, uh, he's a fellow member. Cool. Uh, thought I was going to be alone out here. You were watching? Yeah, uh, you were watching? Isn't that the job? We've had to cover your area until you arrived. You right. You right. See, I like you, sir. Anyways, what brings you to this towering paradise of ours? Money. Uh, actually, not really. I just look, I'm just looking for a change. You got nothing to say to that, sir? Okay, I'm gonna transfer from uh, Iron Horse. An experienced comrade. I can see why Mitch picked you. Yeah, I am really tired. You got a fire going? No. Get her lit. The temperature is about to plummet. You don't want to sit through the storm shivering. Got it. Thanks. Is this a snowstorm? What the freak? Sure. Okay. This is this sucks. 
So how do I do that though? Do I just go out there? Uh, get the bear mace. Who's out there? Who's here? Who's there? Who's there? I got bear mace. It'll sting, I swear. All right, uh, so we gotta start a fire. Uh, apparently there is a snowstorm coming. That is insane. So where do I start the? F oh, we can start the fire here. There's no. I don't see the smoke. Did you light it up yet? No, I'm trying. The wood stove should be around the entrance. Get her lit. Yeah, I'll get her lit. All right, let me do my thing. I'm good at getting her lit. All right, uh, we need firewood. Can we just throw this axe in here? No. I guess we have to go outside and get firewood. Is that what you're telling me? Turn this off. Turn this off. There's no firewood. No firewood? There must be plenty in the shack. That's all Marley did. Marley? The staffer who was in the lookout before you. Before me? Did he find a new job? What happened to him? He said the guy before you. Who was before me? What happened to that guy? Did he get a raise? I think he got a different kind of raise, if you know what I mean. She was one gritty woman. One gritty woman. Okay. Anyways, you better get that fire going. You don't want to sit through the storm. Yeah, you, must yeah. be in your cabin. But if not, you can always grab your supplies from the storage shack. Right. Thank you so much, sir. You're you're very helpful. Not gonna lie. Um okay, we have gas. All we need is really wood. We have matches as well. So yeah, let's go get that firewood though. I'm scared. I'm scared. I'm scared. Is that normal? It's normal to be scared, guys, okay? If you have a little bit of fear, that's how you know you're human. And it's okay to be human sometimes, right? Sometimes? It's okay to be human sometimes. No, it's, a, it's okay to be human all the time. You know, sometimes you have to put it aside your fear. I'm just chatting. I'm just, I'm just, I'm just coping right now. That's it. I'm coping. I'm coping with the fact that I have to come out here by myself. I'm by myself. He making me feel like I'm not alone, but I am entirely alone. You know, I have to come out here by myself into this shed to find what? Firewood? So I can sit through a, a storm? Sure. Oh, here it is. Heck yeah. Man. How strong are you, sir? This is very impressive, not gonna lie. This is crazy. All right. I, I salute you, though. Uh, we need to light it up. Here's some matches. Throw the fir okay, first of all, hold on. Oh, there it is. Got it, my bad. I almost freaked out. All right, start the match. And, oh. No! No! Oh. Oh. Dang. We was about to get three different kinds of fire just now. That was crazy. All right, throw it. Uh that didn't work. Oh, we got a gas at first. We got to throw the gasoline. Ooh. All right, pour the gas here. No. Okay, okay, okay. Imagine I light this whole entire cabin on fire on my first day. <laughs> Imagine. Whoops. This garage behind me is where investigators say the fire or... There we go. Now close it before it, you know, spread. Throw another one. Ah, I see it. I see the smoke. Okay. Nice. Nice to see Tower 11 alive again. Did you report for the night yet? Um, no. You distracted me, sir. I'll do what I do, though. Man, what a nice guy. What his name was again? Not Marley. He didn't tell me his name. It's Connor. Yeah, Connor. I didn't forget. Did you report for the night yet? Uh, let me get to it. You better get to it, then. Here at Iron Park, you are required to report every night before signing off. You don't okay. want to disappoint Mitch on your first night. Okay. Dang, I was already on that on that route. I was about to burn the place down. Okay, you're not my boss. Stop. Um, I don't know what the temperature is, so I can't really I don't I don't know. I don't know. Reported by Jack Nelson. Alright, that's me. Um numbers hike hikers assisted? One. Oh, we really gotta check the weather and everything, bro. What the freak? Put this over oh, put this over here. Oh no! What was that? Why can't I do this? Why can't I look out Oh no? Oh no, that's not mentally healthy. That's not mentally healthy. I threw the match back here. Okay, how do we check the temperature though? I guess there's there are gadgets at the bottom that we can use, I guess. Okay, iron bark trail map. Uh this is the map. I kind of seen the map already. Uh employee training vid. Oh. Welcome to Iron Bark State Park. If you're watching this video, then let me be the first to say congratulations. Is that Jack Septicon? What is this? This is something called testicular green. It reminds me of my wife. I love my wife. Anyways, a little water there. Time to switch brushes. Oops, that's the wrong brush. That's my needle. I'll save that for later. Ah, there it 
is the basting brush. This brush is really great for painting in those details. I think I'll put a little tree here. This is where I buried the bodies. You know what would look good here? A nice, happy cabin right there. Reminds me of when I had an affair with my wife, uh, with a squirrel. Enough about me. Let's read some fan mail sent in by you guys. Eviction notice. Uh, forget the fan mail. We'll be right back after this commercial break. Rest in peace, Bob Ross. Man, I'm already starting to like, un Oop. I'm already starting how to understand how to do our job. Uh, the gadgets were in here. It's in a, uh, the shed, the cabin, the shed, the shed. All right. Oh, we got bear mace out here as well and matches. Nice. Uh, let's see. Uh, we need this right now. So this is our first one. This is to help us capture the wind. Yeah, we got to get a high point and then we'll be fine. Right mouse button to use. About 18, 18 knots. All right, wind speed. 18 knots now we have to find the temperature uh dang what do we use for the temperature oh here's the temperature um can we see it like that or was that like i don't know it's a negative 10 negative 10 degrees i can't tell if that's the oh okay boom 46.4 46.4 now we know how to do it 46.4 so we got our temperature we got our winds uh our wind speed is windy uh, we only have one hiker who is Connor, and our name is Jack Nelson. Hmm. Uh, submit. I wasn't sure if I had to put the right weather condition in there. Uh, that's the right weather condition, right? Or unless it's cloud, it's clear? It's not sunny. I guess it's clear. Sure? Alright, it's clear. Oh, look at the- Copy, new guy. Whew. Alright, a little, a little mini jump scare, my fault. That was no, that was on me. Do you copy, new guy? Um, I'm a new guy. Tower 11 copy. I'm gonna say right here. I think I'm gonna sign off for the day. Okay. Tower 12, signing off. You have a good night, new guy. All right, you have a good night too, Connor. Thanks for the help. Don't want the bed bugs bite. You didn't even have to say that. See, like he made it weird already. He could have just left. And he said that. He said that. No one says that no more. You're right. It's 2002. But like. What is that a metaphor for? Four. Four for four? All right. Good night, Connor. Talk to you tomorrow. Uh, good night, Connor. I don't want to say no names. I'm freaking out. Good, good night. Over and out, bro. Man, what the freak? Okay, well, I did what I had to do. Report is submitted. Yep. So I guess we can go to bed now. I'm going to sleep. Get me the heck off this computer. I'm scared now. Can we sleep? Cool. Let's sleep. Let's sleep. I would never take sleep for granted ever again. I just want to go to sleep for a long time. 3.26 a.m. Unintelligible. What's going on? Unintelligible. Okay, we clearly cannot hear what's going on. What? What? Why? Why are we getting up? Why? Why the music doing that? Who's playing that piano? I'm scared. Where's my flashlight? This piano is sinister. I don't like this. Where's my flashlight? I'm about to freak out. Someone here? No. Okay, sure. Oh my gosh, this music. Hello? Connor. Don't say his name. Someone outside my door? Bro, who's what's what's going on? I just woke up. I'm freaking out. I don't know. I don't like this. Not one bit. I'm scared to go outside. It's dark. I don't have a flashlight. Where did my light go? I still I still had to pee. You have to pee. All right, he has to pee. Apparently, do you have to pee? He has to pee. Where do we pee at? Huh? <sighs> on my first night, being out of my cabin gave me a strange feeling. I wonder why. Being left her being left here alone was somewhat unsettling. I bet. I bet they nailed they nailed they nailed the fear. They nailed the fear. I'll be honest. Good job. Good job, devs. 
I freaking hate this. Oh, I can pee right here? Pee on the steps. Let's just pee. Yep, just aim it everywhere. Aim it everywhere. Aim it. Is that a person? Aim in his direction. Maybe he'll see it and run away. Pee everywhere. All right, cool. That was a lovely pee. That was a lovely pee. That was a, what the f Is that a wolf? Is that a wolf? Is that a wolf? Huh, Jacob? Back up, get away from me. Okay, be peed. Let's go to sleep now. Bump that. Dude, I ain't, tra bro. I'd rather deal with the humans than the, no, no, I'm not really. I'd rather deal with the animals. Night two. Okay. Oh, it's just you and the wind. And the time just melts away. Oh, this is beautiful, though. Sip, sip, sip. Dang. See, I like this. I like this. I feel comfortable now. All right, take a photo. Man, that's, that sunset is beautiful. Ooh. Yeah. Take another sip. Ooh, that music hit, too. I like this. Yeah. I love this. Take another photo? Sure, why not? Why the freak not? Well, we can zoom. This camera is amazing. Get it at an angle. Get the birds in it. Hold on, the birds are moving that way. Uh huh. I'm Peter Parker. I'm literally Peter Parker. Let's go. Oh, that was beautiful. That was beautiful right there. Sip, sip. That was a, that was a good flick. That was a nice little sweet moment right there. All right. You copy. Uh, new guy. Connor. This is Connor from Tower Twelve. You copy? I'm I'm here. I copy. I copy. Throw the cup. Yeah, I'm here. Tower 11, do you copy? Uh, copy that, Connor. What's up? I'm right here. Son of a bitch. No more saying cuss words, guys. Uh, excuse me? Nobody bothers to get a camping permit these days anymore. Okay, we'll relax. Do you have eyes on the smoke north of your position? North? Let me have a look. He told me not to go north of my position, you know? He told me not to go more than half of north. So, I'll take a look. Oh, okay. I see it. I see it all right. Dang. Uh-huh. I see it. Oh, no. I guess that's a fight we have to, to deal with. I need you to confirm it. Uh, you see that smoke up north? I see the smoke up north. It's right there. It's right there. Put this down. I see it, man. How did that start? That white smoke up north? Yeah, I see it. It appears to be in the Lazy Trail sector, which is not a registered campsite. Oh. Okay, that's bad? That's weird. People like that don't bother to clean up after themselves. Fire risks are high this season. Okay. Am I checking it out? Checking it out? You told me not to go there. Okay, heading north, I'll report back on it. Yes, do you have any other detail? Is it safe? I don't know about this, y'all. Uh, is it safe? Be alert. Carry your bear spray. Oh, okay, this guy think I'm some kind of chump. After he just told me what happened to Brenda, Martha, uh, who? Karen? I'm not stupid. I'm not about to go out there, but I guess I have to because this is what happens in real life and I have to follow my orders. So, okay, heading north, I'll report back on it. Do you have any other detail? No additional information at the moment. Just follow Lazy Trail. Keep an eye out for any signs of a campfire or any potential hazards along the way. Oh my gosh, dude. Yeah, Don't yeah. Don't forget to carry your bear spray in these woods. Okay, guys. I'll carry the bear spray. Over and out. Man, over and out. Get out of my face, dude. I want to be over and out of this job. I don't care anymore. I hate this place. Jump off. I'm sorry. Not now. Dude, I, why, why? Ugh. He making me do it, uh, his job. Someone else told him to do it, and he told me to do it, because apparently he's my superior. I guess. He just been here longer than me. Man, sounds, sounds familiar. All right. Uh, I'm going to take this with me, and I'm going to take my bear spray, because you never know. Right hand, left hand. Right hand, left hand. Right hand, left hand. All right, let's go, man. Man, this bear spray ain't about to do nothing. Remember, guys, all we got to do is draw a circle, wait to the bear leaves, and then we, we are A-OK. -okay. Surely. All right, we got to go north. Where's north? North is that way. Caution? Bears in area. OK. OK. Sure. Sure. 8.37 PM. Sure. All right, guys. Uh, of course. See, that's why I'm glad I got the flashlight. I followed a trail that led me to the smoke. Why is it dark now? Ah! D 
Did he get eaten by a bear? Nah. I don't like that. Sounds like a him problem. I know this is my job and everything, but I fight fires, not bears. Sorry, sir. This might be your problem. I'm telling you, if I see a bear nibbling on this man's leg, I'm turning around and I'm 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 putting my two weeks notice, my my one hour notice, my my, my one minute notice. You know, you ain't about to see me no more. I, yo, yo, uh, Kayla, chill, Kayla, chill, Kayla, chill. That freaked me out. What happened? Oh, okay. Hold on. Slow down. Let's see. Jack, are you okay? I uh, hope everything is okay. Reply back when you see this. Ooh, whistling. Somebody's whistling. I don't know who that is. Give me a second. Um, the view from my tower. Thanks for the recipe. I might try it tonight. Yep. Those are the pictures I took. I hope you like them, girl. Sister. All right. Who's whistling? Who's whist- Bears can't whistle. You better be careful. Who's whistling? He stopped. Why he stopped though? I didn't tell him to stop. I didn't tell him to stop. He could have kept going. He could have kept going. He could have kept going. He did not have to stop. I got bear spray. Ah! Oh, step out. I, I don't. I don't want to talk to him though. Who's there? Step out here. Um. Dang. Step out here. He's not responding. Or it. Anybody there? No, sh uh, show yourself. Show some authority. Put your chest out. Show yourself. I have bear spray. But where's the fire, though? Was it here? I guess this is the fire. It's a camp. Sure. I had to put it out. Somebody was here. Put it out then. Uh, water? I had to get water to put it out. <sighs> yeah. Okay, sure. He really stopped whistling. That was weird. Is it though? Maybe he just felt like stopping. What are you shaking for? Are you scared? I, I feel you. I feel you. I'd be doing this too, you know? I'd be terrified as well. Here, put it out. Dang. He's just doing his job, but man, he's fearless though. I respect you, sir. Put it down. All right. Where's that bear spray? I want a sucker to try me. That's what I want. Dang, even the bucket scare, bro. See, that's how we know we in the wrong area. Where my bear spray? I have to fight a bear on the way home. I have to fight a bear on the way home. I lost the bear spray. I can't defend myself against a wild animal. Well, I guess I'll be on my way then. Okay. All right then. All right then, it, it's been fun. Man, take the pen with you. You know? Whatever, let's go. I'm running back. I'm running back. I'm not looking back either. I'm not saying a word, guys. I gotta focus. What is that? What is that? What is that? What is that? Y'all heard that? 907. I know y'all heard that. I know y'all heard that. As I hiked back to my tower through the dark, I couldn't shake the sense that something was terribly wrong. My mind couldn't help but think what might have happened. Okay, uh, sure. I'm not scared. Where we at? Huh? We going back home? Let's go back home then. But good thing we didn't fight a bear. Right, guys? You know, I did lose my bear spray. But hey, we made it home safely. Maybe we did, maybe we did fight the bear. Maybe we did win. Let's just tell our family that we won. You know, let's tell the girl that we like. We won. We beat the bear. With our bare hands. Anybody in here? No? Okay. Shut the door. Um, turn the lights off? I'm kidding. I had to report to Connor about the, the vacant campsite. That thing was not vacant. It was vacant when we got there, but... Ugh. Uh, Tower 12, do you copy? Do I want to say Connor? I want to say Tower 12. Tower 12, do you... Uh, do I want to say that, though? Connor, do you copy? If I say Tower 12, who else is listening? They're probably going to say, oh, the person's at the Tower 12, so maybe we need to take them out. Maybe I'm thinking too hard. Co uh, Connor, do you copy? Hey, Connor, do you copy? Loud and clear, new guy. I was just cooking myself some hot... Well, first, what's your... 
status. Uh, talk about the campsite. Are you kidding me? I'm not kidding. Son of a bitch. Stop swearing. It's inappropriate and violent. They never learn, do they? They never learned. Yeah, I guess not. Um, what do you mean? What do you mean? Uh, who who are you talking about? I'm sick of these bastards. It's unbelievable. Okay, relax. Um, has it been happening a lot? This is the third time this month alone. Oh. Anything else you notice in those woods? Um, there was a scream. A scream? Yeah. It must have been one of those red foxes. They sound pretty much like a screaming lady at night. Really? It was manly, though. It was a deep, you know? I don't know what you're talking about, new guy. But I heard from the rangers that a lot of campers have been flocking to that area lately because of the disappearance of those three kids. Three kids? Okay. Okay. Oh, the ones we saw on the poster. Ooh. Okay. Okay. About Interesting. Ago, they were hiking with their families. They went off the trail and just vanished. No trace of them since. Dang. That, wow. Uh, what does that have to do with campers? What happened to those kids? Um, I mean, I guess they wouldn't know because they haven't found them. They were missing. So, what does that have to do with the campers? Well, people have started spreading rumors that the area might be haunted by some entities. No, that's not it. No. Get, out, get that out of here. It's crazy, I know. No. You would think these rumors would scare people off, but apparently it's been the opposite. Hmm. Sometimes, I only wish they were true. What? Okay, you might want to retract that. That's kind of weird, but uh, I guess you hate your job, sure. But dang, that's something crazy to say. Well, at least now you know why Mitch had to staff Tower 11 urgently. <sighs> Thanks. That makes me feel better about this job. Uh, that's unsettling. New guy, I hope you don't believe those rumors. Do you? <laughs> <laughs> oh no <laughs> absolutely not i definitely don't believe any of those rumors like at all you know i i think this is a very nice wholesome job sir great anyways thanks for staying vigilant i better get a raise i gotta contact the authorities so they can take care of this commotion first thing in the morning yeah we can't tolerate these goons anymore yeah those goons if they find them i'll personally make sure they never set foot in this forest again hey okay keep me updated will do over and out Oh, right now. Dang, this is really my job for real. How much we... Oh, am I freaking out? Did I just freak out for nothing? What's going on? Okay, okay. My sister texted me though. What'd she text me? Oh, no service. Okay, who's there? Uh, I'm so jelly, look at that view. By the way, look at uh, look what I I got home to, lasagna, piece of pasta bake. Okay, Uncle Pasta Perinera sauce. Perinera. What? She sent me a recipe. Mom made the same casserole recipe today. Nom nom. Heh. <laughs> look at the photo. Makes me my stomach growl. Uh, as a matter of fact, let me try that recipe. Our messages did not deliver. We are we we don't have no service. Um, that's terrifying. That's scary. I'm scared. I'm scared. What that mean? Can we sleep now? I was too hungry. What? I was too hungry to go to bed without food. So what are we about to do? Cook? I guess. I guess if you hungry, sure. What is this? Pasta. Oh, we're going to make the, the food. Right. We're going to make the... How you make pasta? Uh, put it in the thing. I was... What? I had a feeling I was still missing something. Um, Sauce? I should say do it. Pasta and then uh, marinara sauce and pepperoni. Do we have this stuff? Uh, do we have it in here? Eh, just crouch down. Let's see. Oh, we got a beef patty stuff. Beef stuff? I wasn't sure that went in. Oh, right. Eh. We need sauce. That's what we need. Marinara sauce? Oh. Uh-huh. What else we need? Let's see. Pepperoni, mozzarella cheese, and diced tomatoes. Do we have pepperoni in here? What is this? Burr. Gucci man? What is this? Pepperoni? There it is. Why does pepperoni look so real? Oh. I like that. Uh, what else do we need? And mozzarella cheese and diced tomatoes. Diced tomatoes is, that is a cola. Let's see, what is this? Sliced ham? Bleh. What is this? Bula, uh, mozzarella. Heck yeah. I love, I love mozzarella oh. cheese. It's so good. Why? I have no idea. What is this? Big beans? Bleh. What is this? Pork? Bleh. What is this? Sardines? Bleh. 
Crispy tomato pops? Bleh. Potato, my bad. Eggs? Bleh. Right here. Diced tomatoes. We got it. Heck yeah, baby. Throw the thing in the thing. Woo! Nice. Place the ingredients in a casserole. Bake for uh, 420 degrees. 35, 45 minutes. Hey guys. You there? Ooh. 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 My heart. My heart can't take this no more. New guy, are you there? New guy. You copy? Um. I copy. I copy. I'm here. Uh, what is it? I'm not gonna say Connor, cause you know he might say, might be someone else. You know, what is it? Uh, just reported there to the authorities. Okay. Uh, what did I say? Don't worry. Forest Service agency will take care of it first thing in the morning. Okay. That's for leaving. Hope they can track them down and give them peace of mind. Yeah, surely. We'll keep an eye on things. <sighs> Uh. By the way, I don't see your name here. Did you report for the night yet? Um, I was just getting to it. You better get to it. I just didn't sound to be in a very good mood today. You, you got it. Tell you what, I think I'm gonna hit the sack now. What? I know it's been a tough day, but you're doing an excellent job up there. I don't even know if this is actually Connor. I'm kind of scared. I don't know. I'm, I'm overthinking, maybe? Maybe. I don't know. Uh, my pleasure. Go over 12. Signing off. Over and out. Over and out, bro. What the freak? What's going on? I guess. I'm, I kept checking the oven, but it was still cooking. All right. It looked kind of burnt. It looks burnt. It, it, it might be done. I don't know how you like your food, sir, but I don't know. Um, should I put all this stuff back in the refrigerator? Nah. All right, let's go ahead and do this report. I already know how to do it now, so we can do it like really, really fast, maybe. All right, reported by uh, Jack Nelson. That's me. Hiker's assistant one, I guess. Uh, it's clear. Nothing too crazy. I'm terrified. What's the uh, temperature? Forty point four. Lovely. Forty. Fifty point four. My bad. I can read. A wind speed. What what is that like? What's the wind speed like? Let's find out. Oof. Okay. Okay. 18 knots. 18 knots. Not too windy, not too not too bad, not too shabby. Not too shabby, not too flabby. Put it over here. 18 knots, baby. Man, this job is easy. Too bad it's dangerous. What was the temperature again? Uh, 50.4? I think that's, yeah, I think that's what it was. Uh, I was just trying to put the right weather condition. Cloud? It's cloud, okay. It didn't seem like it was cloud, it seemed like it was pretty clear. Uh, but cool. Uh, let's see. Connor Hawkins. Alright, yep, he was the only one on our thingy. Nice. We did our job. And our food is done. Man, what a great night. I just remember the smell of fresh sizzling cheese. I like eating in bed. Same. Is he gonna have to poop after this? Yeah. Are we pooping outside? Nope. Right in that furnace and we're gonna burn it. It might be a crazy smell. You know, hot box it, cause I'm not going outside. Yum, yum, yum. I love lasagna. I love pizza. I love pasta. I love all that stuff. But I'm a very intelligent pizza enjoyer. I love pizza uh, of everything. I'm a pizza connoisseur. Everything but vegetables. I like all meats. Arby's? My bad. I love pepperoni, ham, pork. Ham and pork is the same thing. I was already full. Cool. Nice. That was delicious. Put it back in the oven. Save it for later. Good bink. Okay. Yep. Cool. I could have kept it in the refrigerator. You right. You right. You you right. You right. Good bink. There we go. Man, that was great. Nice. On a scale of 1 to 10, how good was it? I was getting cold. Thought I'd get wood, but get wood stove lit. Okay. All right, caveman. Let's go get a, a flashlight and we'll go down and get some wood. All right, let's go down. Should I get the bear spray? Um, ain't no bears out here. 
Man, I don't care. I might have to protect myself. Who knows, right? Who knows? It might not be a bear, but it might be something that stares. Right? Like a human being. Like a person. A person stares. Basically, I'm saying I don't want to deal with a human being. Dude, I would rather deal with an animal than a human being. I'm not kidding. I'm not kidding when I say this. Get the wood. Let's go back. What was that? I'm freaking out. I'm just freaking out. My bad. I'm freaking out. 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 Alright, put it right there. Get the match. Fire! There we go. Heck yeah. Close that. Nice. Nice. Do I put all this back? I low-key I low key feel bad for not even putting it back. And it'll be alright. It'll be okay. Alright. Now we got some heat. I think it's time we go to bed. I always close the boards outside before heading to bed. Okay. Let's get the flashlight. Going back outside. You know what? I respect it, sir. You're doing things that a lot of people wouldn't do, though. You know? Like, you're taking care of your place. Your thing. You know? Being careful. Close the boards. Come on. There we go. Close all the boards. Oh, there's two more. I forgot. I didn't even see those. Boom. And... Where's the last one? Right here. Did they, did they just make those? I did not see those two there. Let's get inside. Ugh. Alright. We're done? Cool. Now we can sleep. Whew. Get a good, nice rest. Man. I love my job. 2.27 a.m. Uh... I was walking by some feeling that caused my eyes to drift open. Wait. Who's that whistling? Bro, don't tell me he's here. Who is that? Hello? Oh. 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 Bro, bro, what is that? What is that? I don't want to get up. I don't see nothing. I don't see nothing outside, but like, I see a shadow. Get up, bro. That was very strange about that night. There was something very strange about that night. Is he going to come in here? What was that? Bro. Bro. What do I do? Am I in danger? Okay. Crouch. Bro. He's literally outside of my cabin. Get the bear mace. Where's the bear mace? Don't turn on the radio. I'm sorry. Dude, I'm freaking out, bro. Okay. Is he... Is he still out there? He might be gone now, but... Turn on the light. Okay. 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 What is that? Jack, dude. I don't know what you did in real life, bro, but I would have called the authorities immediately, 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 immediately. Hello, 911? Someone's outside of my door and they put a... I... I think they cursed me. I, I... Get the bear mace, bro. I don't got time for this. Where are you? Nah. Where you go, though? Did he jump down? Did he fly away? Who am I dealing with, Jeepers Creepers? I don't know, bro. This right here is is nuts. Why would you do this? I didn't know what to make of it at the moment. Ooh. Sorry. The only logical thing I could think of is that of of what's to con to contact Connor. Yeah, right, 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 right. Makes sense. Keep the bear spray in your right hand, though. You know. Ooh, this is nuts. Uh, Connor. Do I say Connor? I'll say wake up. Um, uh, wake up. This is the first of the Wake up, Connor. Uh, I need to talk to you. It's urgent. Hello? Do you have any idea what time it is? Yeah, but we're doing our job. Don't get mad at me. There's something outside my door. Something eerie about this place. There's something outside of my door. Just gonna wait until morning. Mention the skull. See, oh my gosh. I don't think these are kids messing around. What if this is not a prank? I did these are not kids, dude. These kids can be pretty creative with these pranks. You watch too many horror movies. Maybe they thought it would be funny. <sighs> no, 
nah, that's not it, bro. This feels like some sort of ritual. This is serious. You don't understand, do you? Um, this is serious. I'm very serious. Let's not get carried away, new guy. We're in the middle of nowhere. Yeah, which makes a lot of sense. Like, you know, like, think about it. All right. Here's what we'll do. I'll send someone to check in on you tomorrow. Tomorrow? What about tonight? This is happening now. For now, just lock your door. Take a deep breath. And try to get some rest. We can't do much in the dark. It'll be morning before you know it. Try to get some sleep, Jack. But we're not. I'm not saying nothing to you, you coward! You're a coward! I'm not helping him with nothing else! But there's not there's not much else I could I, I could have done in the dark. So, sorry, man. Freak! Man, he's a coward! I hate cowards. Let's go to sleep, dude. Hopefully we get help in the morning like he said. Wait, man, that's why Martha is gone. Night three. Next day I woke up not being so sure if last night was real or just a dream. Connor tried to reason it as a harmless prank by some kids. But, some, but there's something about that night that just felt darker. There's something strange happening in those woods. 8.34 him all right and uh i occupy most of my days either with a simple maintenance and or in, a ma simple maintenance in order around the tower or by scanning the, de the densities of trees are all around me my paranoia for these woods only grew after last night which led me to an extra vigilant moving forward uh Okay, I like that man. Respect. You need to clean you need to clean your by binoculars. Alright, clean. Oh there he is, clean. Clean it. Yeah, let's just get all that gunk off, you know? Yeah. Oh, whoa, whoops. I was freaking out just now. There we go. Uh-huh. Nice and clean, baby. What the freak? A flare? Who did that? Okay, I guess that's someone that needs help. Surely. Let's go over. Hello? Oh my god. Is anyone there? Oh, uh, um. I, I need help. Please, someone answer. I don't want to, but I got to. It's my job. I don't want to get fired. No pun intended. Because you know we are fire watchers. Get it? Never mind. Hello? Can anyone hear me? <sighs> uh, who's this? Uh. Thank goodness, uh, I'm lost, and I'm I'm really starting to freak out. All right, take a deep breath. Okay, okay. Mm -hmm. Now, okay, now let me know. I will be a good first responder. Just saying. What's going on, or what's the situation? I I don't even know where to start. I, I went out to explore the area and lost track of time. Okay. And, and now it's dark, and I can't remember the trail back to my truck. Uh, I think I think I'm lost. Okay. Um, can you describe your clothing? Is that mm, I don't know. What equipment do you have with you? Hmm, that's not going to really help. Uh, what is your current location? How will he know he's lost? Uh, can you describe your clothing? I'm wearing a red jacket, camo pants, mm -hmm. and a green backpack. Okay. That stands out. So now that means I know. Uh, that means I can find out. I can I can see you if I see you, you know? What equipment do you have with you? Uh, yeah. I have a flashlight, a compass, a fully charged two-way radio, a flare gun, and, and some of my camping equipment. Okay. All right. What is your current location? Uh, I'm in the middle of the woods on this trail surrounded by trees. Everything looks different at night. Makes sense. You're very dark. I thought shooting a few flare gun shots might get someone's attention, but no one's come yet. All, right. All it did was light up the trees and make everything look even scarier. I just want to find a way out of here. Oh, okay. Well, good thing it's my job. <laughs> Can you describe your surroundings? Do you remember the landmarks? Which direction are you facing right now? What is your surroundings? I'm surrounded by trees, and I remember passing a small stream earlier. Okay, a straw, small stream. I get the trees part. You ain't got to be smart. What direction are you facing right now? I'm walking towards west right now because I remember walking east when I came here. Okay. East. Oh, thank goodness. I see it. 
You see what? The light? What do you see? What do you see? I'm at a trail intersection now, but I can't remember if I should take the right trail or the left to get back to the trailhead. Can you help me? The trailhead? Um, when I had to go up the, the mountain, or when I left it, I was on the left side. So if he's facing, you know, the sign where it's telling you to go boom, 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 then boom. Let me scan the map and get back to you. I'm scared. I'm scared. I'm scared. I'm scared. What is that, tinnitus? What is that, tinnitus? Am I losing my hearing? I'm only in my 20s. I'm not that old. Uh, hello? Huh? What? Uh, are, are you still there? Both of these trails seem pretty similar. Okay. I'm, I'm just so anxious about... Okay, shut up. Let me do the thing. Okay. Ooh. The freak is going on. Okay, uh, the map. Where's the map? I don't know. Hold on. Let's see. Let's see. Pigeon Plaz, Split Rock. Uh, where is he? He said Trailhead or something? I'm going to tell him left. It looks like he has to go left. That's what it looks like. Not going to lie. The other place, it looks like bears are in this area or something. I don't want to leave him to his death. I hope I'm doing this right, dude. I'm at a trail intersection now, but I can't remember if I should take the right trail or the left to get back to the trailhead. Can you help me? Back to the trailhead. Hold on, hold on. Uh, hello? What? 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 Uh, are both of these? Uh, uh I'm thinking, do you want the right answer or the wrong? Just let me think, sir. I'll be right with you. Man, I see why I first responded to being, being annoyed all the time. Cuz, it's like, let me think. I'm sorry. I don't, I, I, uh, I'm gonna say left. Left? I'm gonna say left. Left? Yes, sir. You have to go left. I'm at a trail intersection. <laughs> I knew it. Mm -hmm. I thought it looked familiar. Yeah. I couldn't have trusted myself with this decision. <laughs> Thanks for helping me through this. Uh, oof. Man, if you get eaten by bears, it's not my fault. Say goodbye to my job. Uh, you're welcome. Making decisions in the dark can be challenging. Hope you reach back to the trailhead safely. You don't want to say nothing back? Hello? I'm right here. What do you mean? I hear you. Oh, my. Hear what? I hear your whistles. Oh no! That, I'm not whistling. Um, that's not me. I mean, I'm. That's not me. What? What? I see you behind the trees to my right. No. Why would I be using the equipment outside and in, in, in behind trees and stuff? That doesn't make sense. Are you sure? That's not me. That's not me. You're freaking me out. Oh, oh no! Oh no! Where's the bear, man? Where's the bear mace? Oh gosh! Get up! Okay. Okay. Hello? Who the heck is that? All right. Five, four, three. Bear mace! There's no way I just sprayed this man with bear mace. And he took it like a champ, too. He's just staring at me. All I can feel is guilt right now. Bro. Holy moly. What took you so long in there? I've been knocking for hours. I was asked to check in on you. What were you up to, pal? I was assisting a lost hiker. Just finished up on a report. I was assisting a lost hiker. Should I tell him that? Uh, I was finishing up on a report. No worries, pal. Got your tower supplies here. Just the usual essentials. Here you go. I feel like I'm going to pass out if I keep holding this for one more second. Yeah, just uh, give it to me. See ya. What were you doing last night? What do you mean? Well, why you want to know? My job. Up north. Why were you there? Why is it any of your business? I'm sorry. You're my you're my uh, superior. No, you're not. I don't know who you are, sir. I wouldn't screw around out there, pal. Uh, I was required to investigate on a campfire smoke. Oh Lord, have mercy. Yeah, I was doing my job. Nasty business up there, pal. Yeah. Bobcats and bears. You be careful out there, pal. These woods aren't normal, and there's stuff out there that would love to get a piece of you. What? Get the bear mace. Get the bear. Why are you talking like that? A piece of me? They ain't get a piece of nothing. The only piece they getting is a a 
knuckle sandwich. Ain't nobody about to get a piece of this. Not me. I am not on the menu, sir. Not to mention, you'd be a quite, you'd be what? You'd be quite a distant from help if anything happened. Uh, I got enough to keep me occupied here. Absolutely. It's a busy job. I'm about to push you, like, I'm about to push you off. I've been hearing you've been a bit on the edge. Everything all right? Um, just not getting used to the new environment. Mention the skull. Should I, though? Should I? He's weird. I don't want to... Maybe they're trying to paint him as being weird, but maybe not. I'm I'm just getting used to the new environment, sir. That's the spirit. I won't tell you nothing. I'm just going to leave. Did you notice anything unusual on your hike up north yesterday? Oh, I have to tell him. Okay, well, I guess let's tell him then. Sure. Mention the skull. He's saying nothing. Oh, Lord, have mercy. Did you take a photo of it before cleaning it up? Oh, he's right. He's freaking right. Why didn't we do that? No, I, uh, no. Didn't think about it. You know, it's best we don't dwell on these things, pal. Besides, we can't do anything without the evidence. Anyways, it's getting late. I better get going now. Just keep watch. Thanks for the supplies. Where's my bear maze? Oh, dude, I hate that too, bro. I hate him. He He's weird. He's like, man, I don't want to judge a book by his cover, but that's exactly what I'm doing. It's like this dude is like talking weird. He's acting weird. He's, he, I don't know. I feel like he's setting me up for something. All right. Well, uh, what now? I was too hungry to go to bed without food. Let's cook some food then. I guess we can make the same thing we made yesterday. Oh, no, we have leftovers. That's what we have. Can't go wrong with leftovers, right, guys? Eat it up. Y'all saw how much I sprayed in his eyes? You would think he would react and start crying and stuff and freaking out and probably possibly fall off the tower, but that didn't happen. Good job, I guess? I don't know. Maybe I should use more. This is crazy so far, though. Uh, I'll be honest. I know what I saw. I know what I saw. But now we look crazy because we all because we didn't take a picture, you know? But you know what? I didn't forget about that one guy that was on that trail that was trying to get to the trailhead. Who knows what he is right now? He might, he, he's probably a cult member by now, you know? All right, well, I guess that's it for tonight. Let's go to bed. I said to report. All right, we have to report. Uh, where's the wind thing? Let's go ahead and knock this out. Let's knock this out. Man, I love my job. What is that? 27 is very windy tonight. Very windy. 27 and 54.8. Mm-hmm. 27... 54.8 heck yeah i love my job we'll say wind uh nobody because connor's probably sleep gone or dead hopefully not dead hopefully not but he's yeah somewhere jack nelson this is my thing nice i love my job i love my job i love my job where's my bear mace okay all right right by my countertop Right by my countertop, right by my alarm clock. It was getting cold. Get some. Oh no! Are you serious? He's serious though. He's serious though. Um, can we get the axe? We we could be Kratos for tonight if we need to, you know. Oh, here it is. Flashlight. Boom. All right. Right hand. Left hand. Let's go. Who's there? This is not about to be fun. I ain't gonna lie. I'm gonna have to carry the wood, so I'm gonna have to leave the bear mace up here. So uh, I hope you know how to fight. I don't know, hope you know how to defend yourself. Oh no. Oh no. Where'd the music go? Oh no. Oh no. Let's run there. Let's just run there. Let's just run there. Let's just run there. Let's just get the wood and get out. Oh, you just gave me a heart attack. 
He really about to give me a heart attack, bro. I need water. I need water. Bro, I can't keep doing this to myself. What are you doing out here, sir? You a janitor. There's no, do you have, do you, don't you have a place to like janit? Bro, you just gave me a heart attack. Oh, I'm so, I understand loneliness. Can't, can't make the, what? I can understand loneliness can make the mind play tricks on you. Sir, I'm not lonely. Speak for yourself. Who, who are you? What's your name? What are you doing here? What's your, what's your name? Eh, no, what are you doing here? No need to be alarmed. I'm a worker. I was just doing some routine, what? Routine maintenance on the radio tower over there. Thought I, what? Thought I say hi the, to the new guy every, everyone's been talking about. Oh. Do you usually work this late? Every Sunday, just trying to keep the communication lines open. You must ensure that the right message reached the right places. Wouldn't you agree? Okay. Yeah, that's a good way to put it. Sure. Right. We rely on information about fire sightings. I agree. Fire risk are high this season. Um, yeah, fire sightings. Absolutely, but some fries, some fries, some fries, some fries are meant to burn and no amount of prevention can stop them. What do you mean, sir? I don't even want to. What do you mean? What do you mean, bro? Nature has its own plans. Some things can't be controlled no matter how hard we try. Okay. Okay. But you know, people aren't nature. You know, we're not plants and stuff. Sometimes it's not just nature. Sometimes it's humanity. That's all I'm saying, bro. And sometimes disasters are just another form of cleansing. What? A way for the land to purify itself. Okay, Thanos. Sure, I guess. I guess. All right. This man wants balance. He wants balance. I don't know about all that. I should head back to the tower now. It's getting late. I'll see you around. See, Silas? That's his name? I'm not even going to ask him what his name is. Uh, it's getting late. Have a good night, Jack. Hope you sleep well. But remember. Remember what? Curiosity can lead to places you'd rather not go. Farewell, Jack. Okay. Okay. All right, sir. All right. The guy gave out the creepiest vibes. Yep, he sure did. He sure did. Look at him go. All right, sir. You have a good one, okay? What the freak was that? Why he, why he said all that? Why he said all that? Ain't he just a janitor? How long he been working out here? What does he really do? Does he really work? Nah, there's no way. I'm not, I'm, what was that? I'm hearing stuff? I'm hearing stuff, but it's time to get back. Let's go. No, nah, that was crazy though. He was speaking nonsense. I ain't heard a thing he said. He said so much and nothing at the same time. I get it. I don't. I already know. I already know. I just got a feeling that he knows something that we don't know, you know? He's been out here long enough. What the freak was that? Get the bear mate. Okay, where's my mace? Where's my mace at? Where's the mace? Where's the mace? Where's the mace in this place? I don't know where I put it at. Uh, oh, here it is. Ooh. Put it on my countertop. That's my blick from now on. Okay, we don't have a blick, Ashley, but that'll do. Set, this, set the whole forest on fire and dip. This place needs to be ridden. He right, too. Smoke coming out of your tower. <sighs> okay. Don't tell me you're not in there. I see smoke coming from out of your tower. Don't tell me you're not in there. What do you mean? What? New guy. Oh, that's Connor. You there? Um, I'm here. Man, I ain't gonna lie. Well, he said sometimes disaster is good, you know, because of cleansing. He might be right in this case. Set the whole forest on fire and dip. He's one of them. He needs to be cleansed. You got me now. Um, this is Jack. I'm not gonna say that. Right here, loud and clear. I'm loud and clear. <sighs> Finally. I've been trying to reach you for a while now. Where have you been? Uh, where have we been? Um, I went down to get firewood. Should I tell him about Silas? Connor might be good. I'm scared of Connor, though. I went down to get firewood. It doesn't exactly take ages to get just some firewood. Okay, I ran into the radio tower worker. Ran into who? What do you mean, who? Who? What do you mean, who? Your employee? Your fellow employee, sir. The, 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 okay. Uh, the guy maintaining the nearby radio tower? The guy nearby radio tower worker? Ma uh, the guy maintaining the nearby radio tower. Respond, hello? <sighs> Is this about yesterday? 
What? What are you talking about? I'm trying to yank my chain now. What do you mean? That radio tower has been out of service for ages now. What do you... Huh? Oh, no. I got chills. I got chills. Chill. I got chills. It was closed down years ago after a lightning strike fried its systems. And its repair cost was deemed too costly. Oh. Okay, so is he delusional while he's there then? Its repair date was postponed until the next big funding. Which is no time soon, according to Mitch. Okay. Um, so who did I just talk to? Look, if what you're saying is true, it could be another one of those goons playing pranks on you. It was an old man! It's not no goon! He clear he had a generous suit and everything. He knew my name. Knew your name? Yeah. You think he's been listening? Uh, he's a radio worker, so I guess he knows something about being on a radio. He's probably listening in right now, you know? Hearing everything we say. Uh, possibly. Either way, disguising as a staff member is strictly forbidden according to park guidelines. Okay. Next time you see him, get his information or take a photo. We need to figure this out. Sure. Anyways, I'm seeing that you've already reported. I think I'm gonna hit the sack now. You always hit in a sack, bro. Like, huh, sure? Yeah, me too. Tower 12, signing off. Uh, out. good night, over and uh, Man, I'm going to sleep, bump off. I am telling him good night. He can have a bad night for all I care. Don't let the bed buzz bite. I'm sorry. Man, it's like, get the bear mace. Like, stop trying to, stop trying me. What, like, what's going on out here? He doesn't work here? Who is Silas? Is Connor even real? Why they left that skull outside of my crib? What is going on? I don't like this place no more. I didn't like it from the begin with, but now I'm I, I'm starting to regret. I'm starting to regret. Man, this place sucks. Can we go to sleep now? Ugh. What the freak? Let me guess. We're going to have another bad dream? I hate this, bro. My unease was starting to grow with each passing day. So, when I signed off that night, I told myself that it was just a change of environment that I needed to get used to. The strangeness I'd seen so far in those woods wasn't enough to cause an alarm yet. However, that would soon change. Two nights later. Bro. Jack. Jack, I don't know how, bro. It's 918 right now. Oh, what the minute? freak? Oh, I got a minute? Oh. Okay. What is it? Well, good news. Just heard from the HQ. They say we've got a new system update on the computer. New system update? Mitch wanted me to let you know. They say it's an important security update. Mitch wants okay, um sh okay. No more snoopers, I guess. Sure yeah, surely. Alright, let's see how good this update is. Um how do I update a computer? Well, to be honest with you, all this new technology is not really my thing. Okay. Dare I say it? These computers are probably going to take all our jobs one day. Yes. Well he predicted it, sure. Anyways, for now use the console. Okay. I'm sure a young man like you can figure it out. Yeah, yeah, I I got it. Thanks, bud. Let's alright, let's do this, bro. Um, we have to update the computer. Let's see. Checks for available system update. Yep. JK UPD. Three updates found in total. Filtering. There we go. Uh let's see. Is it updated? I think I did it. Um True? Oh, oh, I see. We check to see if there is an update like this. Oh, whoops. Check a P U D. Huh? S H K U P D. Okay, we have three updates. And then, uh, what? We use for current version. Installs. Okay, let's check for the current version. Let's see what update this is. Uh, K V E R. We have 207, the new one is 2.1, uh, so let's update, yeah, let's just update, I guess. We could have just done that, but there we go. Enter the package 1.1. Huh? Enter the update package code. Where is that? Package code is, where is it? 434-6084. 434-6084. Package found looking for serviceable lines. All right, enter the active line. An active line? Um, zero four five? Huh? Not available. Got it. Five nine eight seven. 
Got it. Uh, five, four, a seven. Oh, oh, it worked. Cool. Update complete. Your system is now up. To what the freak? Okay. 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 Who turned out the lights? Okay. 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 Where did where did where did my light where my where did my flashlight go? Dude, I can't see a thing. There's a flashlight here, but I can't I can't grab it. All right, bro, we gotta go down there, and I can't even see where my flashlight is. This is ugh, I hate this. I hate this already. It's raining outside. Did you get an umbrella? Huh? No umbrella. No no umbrella is crazy. All right, sure. When you get sick, don't start crying. When you get caught, don't start crying. This is dumb. All right, let's go down and get the generator. I love my job. Surely it was that thunderstorm, right? Surely it wasn't Solace or Connor. The generator ran out of gas. Okay, let's go back and get some gas. Oh, oh, I thought somebody was behind me. Look at the moon though, it's so bright. It's so bright, so bright. I hate this place. I hate this place. I hate this place. Gosh, I don't even want to take another step. Huh? Who's here? Who's watching me? Dude, I'm losing my mind in this place. I'm not the only one that lost their mind. Go back up. What? I was getting cold. I had to pee. You had to pee? You had to pee. I really had to pee before going back up. Hmm. Okay. Okay. Let's put the gasoline right there. Let's pee. Shut the door. Every time he has to pee, I have to pee. How that work? Throw it everywhere. Pee everywhere. That's enough. All right. Oh. Uh, are we good? Can we leave? Is somebody out there? I'm terrified though. I don't want to leave this place. I'll sleep here for the night if I have to, you know? Right, guys? Right, guys? Let's go, then. Let's go. Let's get out of here. Let's go. Let's go back to our bed. Let's go back to our bed. Let's go back to our bed. What the freak? One week later. A whole week passed by. Time was flying by. Connor's generator was under maintenance, which meant I had to cover his area for the past two days. Give it up for Jack, bro. Jack, you a soldier, bro. I salute. Uh, when there was no fires going, the only thing I'd do is check in on Connor twice a day. That might have been the only time I've ever talked. Unless I was talking to myself? 2.34 AM. Why you say that? We got another one. Another what? I know it's late, but you're gonna wanna see this one, Jack. I don't think I want to. I Jack. rather. Jack, I need you to wake up. You copy? Do I copy? Do I have to though? I'm over it, man. I hate this job. I'm over it. Oh, whoops! Wrong thing. Not the computer. Jack, you copy? Uh. Why are you still up? Okay, tell you what. I don't have the energy. What happened? I've been here busting my ass, working on that old piece of garbage generator. And now I'm seeing this. Seeing what? I'm seeing more smoke to my west. Looks like we got another camper. It appears to be in your sector. Do you see the campsite from your end? West, let me level this. Let me have a look. I love my job. I love my job, bro. I love doing this job, man. This job is amazing. It's so sick. Like, I, I get to I get to work with the environment. You know, I can keep the environment safe. Who wouldn't want that? Oh, I can't use bear. Oh, the freak. Oh. What? You know what? I don't have it in me to deal with this crap tonight. I'm gonna let you deal with this one. Connor, Connor, I just want to choke you to sleep. If they don't run away this time, take their photos and IDs. Okay. If things get worse, don't hesitate to call HQ for help. H call I'll HQ? Me tomorrow morning. I'm gonna get some rest. Okay, you might not see me or hear from me in tomorrow morning, but we'll see. You have a good night, okay? Sleep tight. Watch. He's gonna wake up with no duo partner out here. I will not be here. I will be home. 
with my wife and kids. If I don't have one, I will get one because I am not about to die here. What is that over here? Um, that looks like a camp. Maybe it's not supposed to be there. All right, put the flashlight over here and um, binoculars. Here we go. Now we can go look at it. All right. What's over here? What do they have going on? Oh, I didn't know what to make of it. All right. Only thing that made sense at the time was to take evidence of it. Right. Okay. Take a photo. Well, let's take a picture then. Yeah, we could have taken a picture of that one thing, but I guess not. I guess this is the only thing that really matters. <gasps> Bro, 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 that eat, bro, I already knew that was gonna happen. Ow, gosh! Okay, 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 okay. Ow, go! Turn the lights off! Hide! Bro, there's no, there's no way he's coming here. Should I run now? I should run. I should run. Huh? Oh, oh, where am I going? I can't see a thing because it's very dark outside. I need to run faster. I need to run faster. He's on my tail. He's on my tail. He's on my tail. So clutch. That was so clutch. That was so clutch. Run faster. Are we gonna make it? Is my life over? I don't know yet. This music is terrifying though. Where am I going? He's not following me. I don't know where the heck I'm going, but I'm going home. I'm not staying here. No more. No longer. There's no way. Dang, that was so clutch, dude. Oh, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Should I, should I call the guy? Bump that. I quit. I quit. Get to the van now, Jack! Come on, Jack. Go! Oh, it's fast! It's fast! Hey, Mr. Door. Let's go. Nice. Adrenaline. 
Okay, as adrenaline kicked in, I hit the gas and drove to the, to the nearest ranger cabin. Out of breath, I radioed in to alert the HQ. Look, Jack, we all get a little stir crazy out here, Mitch answered. Mitch? Next morning, authorities allegedly ran a small investigation of the area, but of course, they met with no signs of misconduct. No one ever believed my story, dismissing, dismissing it as a product of isolation. Just to stick to looking for fires. What? Just stick to looking for fires, Mitch offered. However, that was the last time I ever set my foot in those woods. The unease still sits heavy with sits heavy in my stomach. Even though many years have passed, the experience still feels feels vivid in my memory. My family thought I was making the whole thing up, which is really out of my character. But I know what I saw. Real or not, after dark, these woods can become a haven for illegal activities. So if any of you plan on going camping soon, please be safe. Once again, mwah, chef's kiss. People, if you enjoy, consider pressing the good buttons. You have to, but I would really, really appreciate it. And until next time, I will see y'all in the next video. Goodbye. That was cooked up. That was insane, bro. These stories are absolutely nuts. Another, another W from Fears of Fathom. They, they, you know, it's one of my, uh, one of my favorites. I'll be honest. They're, they're, they're actually really cool. I like when it, I don't know what I was about to say just now, but I hope you have a great day. Hope you have a great night. Be yourself, believe yourself, and never give up. I'll see y'all in the next video. Goodbye. Yeah!